Welcome to ChatPion. In this video, we'll show you how to build a Facebook and Instagram sequence messaging campaign. To be able to use the sequence message, you must have the ChatPion add-on called Messenger Bot Enhancer. The most effective technique to re-engage your user is sequence or drip message. After the current message window closes, sequence messages are normally sent in series. For instance, we will create a bot and a sequence campaign for the bot. The same sequence campaign could be used in other bots too. Sequence campaigns are activated only when a user clicks on that particular button, or, quick reply, where we have the sequence campaign. To create a bot, go to the bot manager from the left navigation menu, select the Facebook page and then click on create new flow button. It'll take you to the visual flow builder. To name the bot, double click on the start bot flow. Now, let's add a trigger and connect it with the start bot flow. To add keywords, double click on the trigger. Add keywords separating them by a comma. Now let's add a reply. Let's take a text reply. Connect it with the start bot flow. Double click to enter text. Let's add buttons with it. To add button, just drag a connector from the button socket and leave the cursor to get button. To configure the button, double click on the button. Add button text. Select the button type as new post back. Give names for the post backs. Now, add replies with them. I am adding image replies. Let's add quick replies with this image reply. Select the type of the quick reply, and give a name for it. Now, for all the quick replies, I am adding e-commerce reply. Where we can add products to show users and they can purchase from there. This bot has several postbacks. We can create a sequence campaign in any postback. Just drag a connector form sequence socket and leave the cursor to get a sequence. Now, let's configure the sequence. Give a name. Select the starting and closing time, and the time zone. If we want to send a sequence message after the 24-hour window, we must select a message tag. Select the types from 24 hours promotional or non-promotional daily. In sequence, promotional messages could be sent in 24 hours window. And non-promotional messages could be sent outside of the 24 hours window, which is daily. By default, there are three sequence message, we can add more or can reduce if we want. To add more, just drag the connector from next socket and leave the cursor. To delete, right-click on it and click Delete button. Give names for postbacks. Now add the replies for each of the postbacks. We can rearrange the bot elements by clicking the Rearrange button. Let's add an e-commerce reply with the text reply. We can add multiple products on the e-commerce reply. We can also use any previously created sequence on the bot. Just double-click on post back and select the sequence you want to use from the list. In the same way, we can create sequence campaigns for Instagram direct message. Let's check this bot, and the sequence on the Facebook Messenger.
As I have clicked on the button, and gone through the post back where we have added a sequence campaign, the campaign should have been activated, and send the sequence message. Wait for the sequence message. Yes, the bot has sent the sequence message. This is how we can use the sequence message to re-engage users. That's all for today. Thank you for watching the video.